Hello, my beautiful Scorpio friends. This is Brandon Fire Daddy Tarot. Throw out some cards for you tonight. Jump back into general reads. You guys know how to do these. They can be about anything. Whatever comes out, I like to be as surprised as you guys are by them. I want to uh, thank you guys for being here again with me. Go ahead and hit that like button again. All your comments, your subscribes, all your support. Love you guys. Can't do this kind of stuff without you, my friends. And I'm glad you're here. Want to ask Source to help me see and speak clearly from Scorpio friends tonight. Help Scorpio see and hear what they need to see and hear out of this. For their highest good. Thank you, my gods. Cannot do this without you. We'll cut this deck up here in just a minute. Playing with the uh, Terror of Moon Garden tonight. Can be kind of a brutal deck. It's a fun deck to play with, though. It's nice to switch things up every once in a while. Still haven't figured out how to keep this thing down. All right, Moongarden Terry, give me card. Scorpio, Knight of Swords is here. Oh, Knight of Swords is here. It could be a card about movement and communication. It's air energy. Or you sleep with Gemini. Might mean something to you, Scorpio. Let's see what's going on. Ouch, you. Five cups is here. What you spill cups going on, Scorpio? What's going on here? So we put you all five of cups about something. This little uh, lightning pony or whatever you want to call them down here. <laughs> Definitely it's mare in the chart. It says they're a bit immature. It's page of swords. Page of swords. Pages can definitely talk about immature individual individuals or people a little younger than you. Or just younger people in general. What'd they do? That's what I'm curious about. What'd they do? How does Scorpio handle it? That's what I want to know. Seven Wands is here. Well, you definitely got your defenses up against them. I mean, that crap there looks about impenetrable. They ain't walking through it, that's for sure. what they do to get you all five of cups? It's now got you seven wands. Got your defenses up sky high. No lovers. It's be a card about a choice of lovers. Do they have a choice of lovers here, or did you? I mean, it says they put you five of cups. can also be a card about trust. Curious, man. Let's see what's going on here. Moon Garden Terror. Give me some cards for Scorpio. Let's shake these up again real quick, Scorpio. Very interesting energy going on here. An immature individual put you five of cups somehow. Now you're all... Uh, Seven Wands keeping your defenses up against them. They probably had some air in the chart. Male or female. Not sure what they did yet. We're going to find out. What is that? Judgments here. Well, they got freaking judgment on them. Scorpio said enough was enough. Judgments there. But a boom, boom, boom. Ouch. Don't look good for them right now. Got a Knight of Wands here, too. Is that what they were about? Is that what they were about? Knight of Wands, a lot of readers have called this a fire pony. They uh, like to get around, did they? That's how they got you five of cups. That's how they got you five of cups. They like to get around town. Scorpio said enough was enough. Put judgment down on their ass. That's what happened here. Starting to make a little more sense now. Moon Garden Terra loves, loves, loves to eat energies like these for breakfast. Call them out. Ace Pentacles. Scorpio, man. They're going to bring you a pentacle. There's a lot of movement here. A lot of movement here. They got the lovers up there. They're going to bring you a pentacle. Hey, Scorpio, look what I got for you, man. I got you a gift because I did you freaking wrong. It's not going to make it right, but it makes me feel better. That's what this is about, isn't it? They might be trying to come back here. That's probably why your defenses are up, because you probably already know this. You don't need a terror reader to tell you this shit. They probably already got in touch with you. Knights can definitely be about communication. Oh, Nine of Cups. How cute. They want you to believe that they're Nine of Cups. Wish fulfillment. I think Scorpio is going to get their wish fulfillment elsewhere because the lovers is here. You got a choice of lovers. You don't have to stick with this old shitty energy, Scorpio. 
Don't have to stick with it, man. Don't have to let it come back. Yo, here's some new energy. Who is this? King of the world. King of Pentacles here. This is the one that's actually going to bring you some coin, not this little bum cheater down here, whatever the heck they were about. Immature little, I'm not even going to say it. Scorpio, who's this king of the world, man? I want to know some more about this individual. Get a few more cards out of this, please. What do we got? Page of Cups is here. Yo, Scorpio, have you met this person yet? I don't think you have. I don't think you've met this new yet. I don't think you've met this new person yet. Pages can talk about the future. Page of Cups can talk about intuition. Big time. Who is this person, Scorpio? Lots of cups on them. There's Knight of Cups. That might be your energy right now. You're probably intuitively looking for this. I'd say it's been a while since this happened, this old stuff. Judgment's there. It's been a while. I'd say this person's been trying to get you back for a while, too. That's why your defenses have been up about them. We got cards, please. Hangman. Yeah, he was Hangman for a while about that old person, weren't you? Death card, end of a cycle. Old cycle's ending, new cycle's beginning. That shit down here is done. Scorpio put judgment on and said, it's done. That's your card, by the way, the death card, Scorpio. Yeah, man. Scorpio energy big time there. Five pentacles. What, they put you broke too? Did they put you broke too? Not just enough to cheat on you, but put you broke. No wonder why you fucking got away from them, dude. Jesus Christ, I love this deck. It's so fun to play with energies like this in it. Ace of Swords is here. You cut right through that shit. It says you're going out and fucking making a new uh, way for yourself, though, Scorpio. That's what I'm seeing here. That's what I'm seeing here. You get this uh, new coming in. It's King of Pentacles, man. Sitting on top of lovers. Probably coming in the near future. It does say you're moving toward him, though, Scorpio. And that this old cycle is done. And with the death card, there's always the end of an old cycle and the beginning of a new one. And that is your card, Scorpio. This is great, man. I like this. This is a, a this is a Scorpio story right here. I've got a pretty good amount of Scorpio in chart. We'd be pretty brutal when you piss us off and when you do us wrong. And uh, I see a Scorpio here that got cheated on and uh, probably used for money too, because there's five Pentacles there. Then there's this Ace of Pentacles right here. Oh, Scorpio, I got you a gift, man. It's enough to make up for all the crap I did? No. No, it's not. It's death cards here. This shit is done. It's done. This is fantastic, Scorpio. I love this, man. A couple more cards, please. Two pentacles. Card about balance. It can be a card about karmic balance, and then this is how it feels right here. It can also be a card about a balancer, but uh, I ask for more on this, so I'd say your world's coming back into karmic balance, Scorpio. Whoever this new is you're going to meet down here, it's king of the world, male or female, got some earth in their chart most likely. Going to help you bring karmic balance back to your world, balance back to your world in general. Five swords. I said you put swords all over that shit up there, didn't you? King cubs. Yo, Scorpio's got some growing to do, don't they? Grown from that night energy, growing up into a king here, cutting off this old cycle because you're not going to put up with this shit anymore. Kings don't put up with shit like that, Scorpio. Male or female, doesn't matter. Terra doesn't know gender. Terra knows energy. Scorpio is not going to put up with this kind of shit anymore. They're not going to put up with things that they deserve, things they want out of life. Down here on this side of the spread, wherever this king of cups, or this uh, king of pentacles is, Coming in here in the near future, it's probably going to be a lot better than what you went through. And so it's going to bring your world back into balance. But most likely, you're going to bring your world back into balance yourself. And that's how you're going to attract a new, fulfilling love. Anyway, enough ranting for me. Enough of the uh, New Garden Terror ripping that person a new butthole.
Scratch some Astro Oracles, please. From Scorpio, friends, what do we got? A couple Astro Oracles on this, please, for Scorpio. Scorpio ended in an old crappy cycle here. Somebody who uh, did them very wrong in more than one way. For you, Scorpio. Proud of you, my friend. Proud of you. What do we got here? Opposition, confrontation, yeah. We know what happened there. Progressions, journey. You know, like I said, you're about to evolve from this is what it feels like to me. And that progressions, this journey on there makes perfect sense. You know what you don't want now, so you can go out and manifest in what you do want. But to do that, it's going to take growth. Anytime you want better in life, it always takes some kind of growth. And you're the one that has to make the growth happen. Awesome. Enjoy the journey. Neptune Vision. Like I said, now you know what you don't want, so you can go get what you do want down here on this end of the spread. North Node, in the future. In the future. How far in the future? I don't know. I have no clue. As long as it takes you to heal from this. But I'd say you're already well on your way. You're already well on your way, Scorpio. You can track in this new down here. It's nice, uh, good, fulfilling love instead of this old shit in the past. I don't know if you've necessarily met that person yet. I don't think you have. But it does say to me you got choice lovers. It means you can be choosy and you can be picky. and You don't just have to take anybody that comes to you, which is a good place to be, man. It's a good place to be with anything, jobs, relationships, religion. I'll stay off that topic. One more of these, or uh, one yin yang, please finish this off. Autumn. Okay, we might have found a little bit of an insight there as to wit. Harvest time. Thomas Autumn. Take this summer to uh, heal from whatever this shit was. Chill out, work on your internal world. You ought to be able to manifest this in a few months. Sounds right to me. There you go, Scorpio. You guys enjoyed this? Be sure to leave a like. If you want to see more like this, check out this video somewhere over here. YouTube thinks you're going to enjoy, and I'll see y'all on the next one. Bye.